gets instant karma enjoying we're watching Ke this we're enjoying watching this kevin and karen moments is entertaining oh she's locked but up there too them in reality is tricky so be cautious to avoid any yeah and this is why i always say be nice to people in retail people go through this on a daily basis and my god like can you imagine you're having a great day you're jolly you're cheerful everything's going your way and then you have one of these people come into your life problems in Japan, American oh, yeah. you don't touch his face. even more like a sore thumb. Case in point. Ooh, Japanese Karen. Are you recording me and my children? Are you recording me and my children? It's illegal. Are you... Yeah, I will say this. Don't film people, especially children, out in the public. That looks creepy as hell. I can see it from her point of view. I wouldn't want anyone filming my child either. Oh, we got an airport, Kevin? Are we gonna see a throwdown? Oh, look at him. Look at the guy in the black. He's like, no, man. This is the wrong day. I'm the wrong person. You don't want none of this. Yeah, this has got to be airport. Self-serve kiosk. Applicants beyond this point. Safety and security. So, one thing I don't like about these videos is they don't show the build-up to it. They don't show you what was said or done before this. So, it's, it's hard to know whose side to take on this. Because sometimes, it could look like someone's a Karen. But then you find out the other side of the story and all of a sudden, the other person's the Karen. It's so whack. <laughs> Oh, they're fighting right behind the counter, too. You think security would already be on this? Oh, you just said the N-word. Yeah, screaming the N-word in the airport, probably not a good idea. He's got the crazy eyes, too. So, get the F back, and then are you ready? I never understood as well how people can get in public like this and just start fights and feuds and stuff. Like, wouldn't you be embarrassed at that point to act like a child like this? Oh, he's got something in his hand. Look at... Oh! Oh, he just got smacked. It looked like, like he had a weapon or something in his right hand. Oh, he got slapped silly. Look at him moving around. He doesn't know where he's at. Happy Friday, yeah, LOL. Wait, wait, wait. What'd you just call him? What'd you call him? Oh, another racist Karen? You wrong. You wrong. It's 2024. And you're... Oh yeah, and you wow. and you're that son of a you're fat and ugly. Did you ever care about that you and late in ten years. So the whole thing is she calls a black person the N word and then says, Why would you care about that? And you know what she said. Like, how can you have this attitude? Like he said in two thousand twenty four to actually treat somebody with such disrespect like that. Treat them less than human. Ew. <laughs> Somebody needs to let this guy know that no refunds cash. are given the same Whoa, way the wait, initial payment. Wait, is that an actual Walmart policy? You can't get a refund. What does it say? Over or under ten dollars? You late in ten years. Look at you. Oh, oh, I missed that. Oh my god, I didn't even see that for. Oh, I looked away for a second. Oh my god, I think I'm gonna be sick. Yeah. I'm pretty sure this is not a Walmart policy. No cash refunds over $10. They're just trying to get the guy a hard time. Somebody needs to let this guy know that refunds are given the same way the initial payment was made. Uh, uh, well, that cash. makes sense. Yeah, so that's the whole thing. Almost every company has this where if you pay on a debit, it goes back on debit. Pay on a credit card, you back on credit cards. Just a security issue. 
to make sure the right person's getting the, the money back. Now, sometimes you can bend the rules. You can like be like, okay, this is a one-time thing. We can do this for you. Try to, especially if the customer pushes back and gets angry, you just give him what he wants and just get him out of there. I don't have three to ten days to wait on my refund. The law says you have to give your customers an option. Can you show me that law? I would really appreciate just giving. Yeah, that's not a law. law. I know my rights. I just want my refund in cash. That's simple. That's not that's a law. I've done it before. I can do it again. We can do only do that if it's oh, under ten dollars. Yeah. That's not a rule. That is definitely not a rule. Yes, sir. Not a law. I guarantee you that's not a Walmart policy, and I guarantee you. If he starts yelling, they're just going to be like, okay, whatever, just get out of here. It's on our policy, so that's what we have to do is what our policy is. But I'm going by law. You can go to a different Walmart and maybe they'll do it. I didn't buy it from, I didn't buy it from a different It's Walmart. not a law that you have to give cash back. Yeah, I use my debit card, which is the same as cash. So I'm going to return. I'm going to refuse it right now. And what's your name? My name's Jeannie. I'm the front end so, manager. What's your name? So why wouldn't they just do... I don't understand it from both points of view here. If you paid on the debit, why would you just refund it on the debit? He said three to five days. I'm assuming in the States it's different because here in Canada, a debit card, once you put the cash on, you can go to, let's say, a bank or instant teller and get it out immediately. It's only on credit cards that it's the three to five days. Michelle, it's right here. Okay. All right. Thank you, Jenny. I'm Michelle. And this is the Walmart. And oh, you North just gave him permission to record it, by yes, the way. Sir, you. you can leave now. Yeah, you can leave, right? We'll call the people. Customer went to a different Walmart and got mm -hmm. his refunding mm -hmm. cash. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. If the customer pushes back so much that he becomes a problem, gets angry, you just give him the cash, get him out of there so he doesn't make a scene. This person did it correctly. <laughs> That's how you do it. That's just sounds service. like it really hurt. Oh yeah. That's how you get knocked out. You don't put your hands on anyone like that, especially the face. That was quick. Oh, he got slapped the hell out. He's out cold. Oh, that's awesome. Do you still call it a traffic stop if the stop is at someone's house? Car. Out of the car, please. Out of the car, please. So I'm We're guessing she didn't stop for the cops the and they car. pulled her over at You're someone's house? Okay. So my, what I'm going to assume is they tried to pull over, she wouldn't stop, she drove into someone's house, like the parking lot or driveway or whatever, and now they're stopping her. Do you understand? Nope. You're gonna you're gonna step out of the vehicle right now, please. Thank you. Are you okay with taking a figuring out her yep. side? I've got another more pressing question. That was a weird Why one. Why does she talk like that? Tell me that you're going inside. Don't just start walking into your house. Oh, they're completely ridiculous. They're still going there. Okay. Why don't you have a seat on the ground? You asked for me. You, ma'am. You asked me. Oh, she's getting angry with the cop too. ID. Yes huh? or no. Well, because you have your purse I on went to go get you some ID. I've got Thank enough for Oh, you can see I the anger in her, so too. I go get him some ID? I don't need an ID right now, ma'am. I Look at her eyes. Like, look at that desk there. It's like, how dare you? How dare you stop me? And why is she bare feet? Like, I can't even walk bare feet most of the time. Like, indoors. But this lady's just walking on the sidewalk, probably in her car, on the grass. To me, that would be too much. I, I hate dirty feet. I'd really appreciate it, though, if you could hang tight for a second. Can we do that, please? I would really appreciate she that. asked me for some ID. I understand. I am her fist is almost clenched up, too. With the person who has threatened to arrest me if I do not comply. Well, ma'am, I'm here And that now. death there Can again. Can I no. get no. my ID? No, ma'am. I'm asking you nicely to please just take a minute right here. Um, I've got a video. He wants me injury. to get so my ID. If this is going to go south, we can just uh, hook He wants five. me to get um, some ID. May I get I some ID? Uh, no. Wait, I, I, so... Yes or no? He, do you no. have... So she's speaking to the woman, but staring at the guy. She refuses to look at her. 
This is a woman with some anger here. That on your but if, video? But if she's that gonna he, continue like this, Do you have that, that on your video? So. That he asked me for some ID? No, ma'am, I was not. She's passing out now, they too. They don't tolerate this lady's game for too long. What's her name? Oh, please tell me she gets arrested. What's her name, ma'am? What's on your ID? What's on your video? On so, your video? The body cam? Uh, I'm comfortable with the video I just watched and with the obvious signs of injury. Sorry, I ma'am. will go. This is man, you're oh. under arrest right now. Why? Oh, she's getting arrested for not showing ID. Domestic battery. I need Drop you to first. stop tensing Why? up. Whoa, I whoa. Domestic battery? So I'm assuming it wasn't just a traffic incident. She assaulted somebody because they sent a video where there was an injury. So she must have assaulted someone. They went to pull her over. She refused to pull over, drove to her house, and they followed her. And now they're trying to do their investigation. She's not cooperating. And now she's about to be arrested. I need you to awesome. Stop. Why? Ma'am, why? I need you to stop. Domestic battery. Okay. Why? I need you to stop. Oh, she's going to break that arm. Domestic battery because why? Okay. She probably beat her husband. Ma'am, I need you to just loosen up. Okay. Ma'am, I don't want to hurt you. Please drop your purse. Please tell me. Like at this point, just do what they say, lady. Please tell me why I'm Ma'am, I advised you. Domestic battery. Are you taping this? Okay, I can see where the anger comes from now. Of course we are. Are you taping this? Oh, she you goes to Trader Joe's. I see the receipt this. there. We are. are you taping this? Yes, we are. Go so why I am I under arrest for domestic... I'm no law expert, but you're probably under arrest for domestic battery because you committed domestic battery. Yeah, that makes sense. Are you able to stand Especially up when they said there's a video you? of the injury. And she doesn't seem to be injured. No. Okay. We're not going to play the game. Listen. Oh, she got taken to the ground there. Recovery position. Here we go. Here we go. And they had to send out three cops for this. I don't think she's okay. Not in the medical sense, just in general. Yeah, she needs some help. Great work. That was really... She was staying on dead weight for sure. Ah, uh, I just need to collect a little bit more yeah. from him. She's not going anywhere. He's opened her eyes numerous times until she sees me standing there. Naperville Police or Naperville Police? I have no idea where that is. The seatbelt across her neck. So I pulled her this way, and as soon as I pulled her this way, she goes... Yeah. Oh, so you know what she's trying to do? She's trying to injure herself so she can blame it on the police. Like, look at these marks. They mistreated me. They hurt me. Time to sue. You gotta let me go. I'm a victim here. Did not have it, but it's better to have yeah. it on her torso. I mean, yeah. yeah. So I rearranged it, but she was able to work it. So one back up. Yeah. I think it's right along the side now. I don't think it's gonna cross her neck anymore. Yeah, she's okay. definitely gonna try and frame them. Thanks. Meet you in there. Yeah, that that sounds good. Because she always has to be a victim. Good. I did nothing wrong. I did everything correct. Everyone else's fault, not mine. I mean, you can either look at it as, as there will be an entertaining video of me trying to carry her dead weight. I'm coming. Uh, or you I could have to go past the PDA. Well, hey, they've got video evidence of everything, and they're perfectly fine to record it. So this Karen should be happy now, right? Could you please tell me why I'm on drugs? Oh, okay. So I've never been in the back of a police car. But do they have that divider where they put your personal stuff? Or is that just an American thing? That's crazy. The only thing I've seen is like from movies and stuff. Could you please tell me why? Now she's trying to be like all soft and spoken and whatnot. Not single person has told me why I am under arrest. They have. Not one. They have. You liar. You're lying right now. They kept telling you. Domestic battery. They said there's a video of the other person being injured. They told you over and over that is a lie. Single person has read me my rights. Not one single person that I don't know about. has told me why I am in the back of a squad car. They have. Could you, the driver of the squad car, please help. tell me? I Domestic just, battery. You please just tell me why I'm in here. Could you? It's not like they just picked you up officer, and kidnapped you. Please tell me why I am in 
this car. Yes, ma'am, I told you, you're under arrest. Okay, we're going to the Naperville jail. For what? For domestic battery charge, ma'am. Why? Because you battered your son <laughs> oh. on video with obvious signs of injury. Yes, ma'am. That's even worse. So she physically abused her son. They tell her that. Tell her it's on video. They keep saying domestic battery, and she keeps saying, why? Why am I arrested for domestic battery? Why? No one's told me. Like, this person is delusional. They live in a reality outside of our reality. Delusions of grandeur. It's not up to debate. It's been done. I have the probable cause for the arrest. We'll be going to do some paperwork, okay? Not okay. Okay. Could you please tell me your oh, name, he wants, She wants officer. the names of all officers so she can I'm sue them. I'm sorry you are choking on your latte. Could you please tell me your name, officer? Ma'am, you've been provided our names. Your I have not been provided anybody's no. names. That's another lie. <laughs> like, what the hell? She even said, what was it, Jenny and Craig or whatever? She said, oh, that's your name. I'll see you later, Jenny and Craig, or whatever, to the officers. She knows the officers' names. I'm wondering if maybe she's on some sort of substance or something, or maybe recently she suffered, like, an injury to the head. Including yours. Could you please provide me the names? She probably doesn't want to tell you because you choose to ignore it. That is true. And by the way... When you say, I was provided your name, how was I provided your what? name? <laughs> because I have absolutely no belongings of mine. Wait, wait, this doesn't even make sense. She goes, how did you tell me what your name is because I don't have my belongings? Is that two different sentences in her head mashed together? Like, what does, how did you provide your name to me and... Why don't I have my belongings? How are those the same sentence? This blows my mind. Like, lady, you need help. <laughs> like, they've told you multiple times why you're there, their names. I'm seriously wondering if there's something wrong with your head right now. With me. What is your name? officer the one who has arrested me and who is driving me to jail please provide your name for the tape okay we all know that everything in this car is taped and now we know that oh, yeah. this female officer she's gonna try and sue them for sure play the victim and who has earrings that hang down to her shoulders and i do not know her name but we all know that this officer is not willing to provide her name even though she is driving me to the police station what was that head shake wait not willing watch his head to shake provide her name even though she is driving me to Look at that head shake. Station. That is like a demon possessed right there. On a Friday afternoon in July, Oh my god, a Friday afternoon. She is saying that I am under arrest, but there is absolutely no record of an arrest. What? There's no record of an... She just arrested you. Oh my god. This lady. Why would there be a record of arrestment if they just arrested you? That's why you're going to the jail. So they can make a record... Of them arresting you. I mean, gee golly, that makes a lot of sense, doesn't it? And I will be. I knew it. The I knew it. Police office for this arrest. All these people and are all this the same. Officer is part and parcel. Of See, I called this right at the beginning. She's gonna try and play the victim. She's gonna try and sue them. Of course, people like her, the narcissist. I did nothing wrong. I did everything correct. Everyone else is the problem, not me. I'm the victim, the eternal victim. Of that, you want to tell me your name yet? Which is illegal for the tape. There is absolutely no grounds. Except for, for the my video where you beat your son. And she and every 
She keeps shaking her head too. Is that demon possessed? Nor any fellow officer will give their names. She's not just mad, she's big mad. Yeah. You want to give me your name? Listen to her tone too. That's a no. Her tone's and getting deeper and angrier. Subpoenaing this tape. Subpoenaing? And he will have your picture and he will know your name. And you will not look good. Oh my Dear God, you might not look good. God, tell me again why I'm in your car. And this person who hopes she can remain nameless has absolutely no. The other thing, too, is. She knew they were filming her when she got arrested because she even said, did you get that on tape? Did you get that on tape? Talking about the body cam on the, the officers. So she was already recorded there being told why she's being arrested. She was already recorded there hearing their names, but now she's trying to play dumb so that they can use this tape and not the body cam, which the cops can just use the body cam to show. Yeah, see, we did our part. We did our job. Nothing to say about why. I am in her car because there is no reason. It's because you're arrested. To you got be caught being your son. Your son. Car. Do you disagree? And again, she will not talk because she does not want my lawyer to identify her. But I guarantee I can identify her. And crossing her legs too. That's a sign of anger too. And by the way. Everybody knows this is for the tape that it is illegal to take somebody from their home. Oh my god, is she gonna is she gonna Oh my god. Oh She's gonna claim that they kidnapped her now, I guarantee it. That it is illegal to take someone from their home. And she's probably gonna say and arrest them against their will or something like that. It's that narcissism without telling them why and this police officer who yep. will not give so me she her just name, said they kidnapped her will also not tell me why and everything about this is illegal oh they must be at the police station there yep i saw the officers we'll walk around the car the station let's see if she's calmed down yeah there's Spoiler no chance alert. of that <laughs> yeah really. like i said she's awake what's her name what Oh my god, she's still what? saying what's her name. Time to walk. Anna, you're getting what? more charges. You're gonna her get name. more charges if you don't stop. Time to walk. What? Like at this her name. at this point, like you're already this deep in it. Why wouldn't you just cooperate, shut your mouth, and then just wait to talk to your lawyer? Like some people, like he said, they talk and talk and add more fire to the fuel and it just adds more charges on. Walk. What are my charges? By the way, has told That's a lie. A Multiple times charge. they said it. That's a weird sentence to say. Wouldn't you just say like, I will remember your face. No, I, I have your face in my brain. Job? Look at him. Oh, you play, playing the latest Little Wayne while you're about to go baby? Do not murder. Oh, it's. This is probably for like anti-abortion. What you? Hey, what you bumping in there, man? This is a house of death, and you saw, cuz. You saw. I'll get hood with it. Now I get it. You have certain beliefs. You can believe either side of it. But when you go and you make it this personal, and you force your beliefs on other people, that's where like the. The line's kind of drawn here. Just, I get it. You don't believe in it. I get it. You want to protest it. That's fine. But when you start attacking people over it, that's that's a line you shouldn't cross. Hey, you hood dudes ain't hard. Y'all baby, too. Hey, you hood dudes ain't tough. Y'all baby, too. I don't see nan one of y'all. He's got the Wolverine facial hair going on too. I don't see nan one of y'all. Look at the traffic jam. I'm yeah, you come on down here, big man. Come on out here and do it. Are we gonna see me. a fight? A protest fight? You, baby, don't do it. Don't I think do he has it. a Bible Save in his hand, too. Kyle. Bruh, how you doing this? Man, come on. Wait, so the person that's to the left, 
at the bottom of the camera. I think they have a rainbow colored umbrella. I think in his right hand he's carrying a Bible. I have no idea what's in the left, some sort of papers. Oh, y'all act so tough in them rap music. You saw. You saw. Soft as baby poo. So. That's so sick of these. That's so sick of these hood dudes coming out here. The hood like dudes. So Nicki Minaj films herself being a famous Karen. Well, hey, at least she isn't Kanye West, the most famous Kevin. Oh, so. <laughs> Oh, I love this. So Nicki Minaj got pulled over, I think, I want to say in Amsterdam or somewhere in, like, Europe, for drugs, I think. And she live-streamed it as she's being pulled over. I love it. Where am I going? I have no idea where you I'm going. You have to go to the police station. What, what, how, what address is that? It's five minutes away. Uh, it's they, five they minutes away. What's, what's the address of the police precinct? Yeah, so at this point, she's being detained and arrested. And she thinks that they're going to let her go and let her drive herself to the police station. As we know, the police, if they arrest you, they don't go, Okay, I'll take it to your word that you're going to drive yourself there. No, they're going to arrest you, take you to the police station, and then let you off. When you uh, will catch your next show, we have to do it very fast. And we will help, but... They even say, like, let's speed this up, let's speed this up. You're talking about my show? Yes. What about it? Uh, yeah. But the question is, like, why would they pull her over in the first place if they knew it was Nicki Minaj? Like, that's very suspicious. Like, oh, talking about his show and whatnot, and like, oh, we'll make it fast. It's only five minutes away. We can get to your show. Like, so you pulled her over knowing it's Nicki Minaj. We told they will help to try to get to there. They'll help to try to get me to my yes. show? So How? Uh, to do it as soon as possible. Uh, but and this is very weird. Doing? So this is very weird that they're arresting her, but saying it's going to be over, it's going to be quick. But why would you detain her if you can just get it over with and you, you know you're going to let her go. Why would you arrest her in the first place? What am I doing? I you never gave anyone arrest. my... I never... Oh, I'm, oh, so I'm under arrest. Yes. But yes. under arrest for what? Stop for you, no. I'm under yeah, arrest Yeah, that's very suspicious. What? Do you Stop know what happened now. when I came you here? You inside. So that's a very suspicious thing as well. Is she goes, what am I under arrest for? And they go, stop filming. That indicates that something is sus right there. Why wouldn't you want to say what she's arrested for? So you want her to stop filming so there's no evidence. Not tell her what she's arrested for. And then you want her to follow them. That's not suspicious at all. Uh, what you say? Can you please stop filming? Look how many cops there are, too. No, I need a lawyer, but I, because I don't know where I'm going. You will get a lawyer at the office. You can contact the lawyer, but if you just step in the car... This is very suspicious. Go as fast as possible. And who's going in, the, in, this, in this vehicle? So please step he will go with you. So they still haven't told her what she's arrested for. Told her to stop filming, and now she's detained and on the police vehicle. But they've already said they're going to let her go. We're going to make this very quick. That's very suspicious right there. Yeah, if this is wild, Jenna. Every time Nicki Minaj filmed herself being a Karen, I'd have two nickels, which isn't a lot, but it's weird Wait, that it happened. What does that say? Nicki Minaj, now they said they found weed and that another group of people... Have to come here to weigh the pre-rolls. Keep in mind they took my bag without consent. My security has already advised them that these pre-rolls belong to him. And oh yeah, and the pilot wants me to take my ID post down. So they arrested her. Told her to take down social media. Told her not to film. Told her that they're going to arrest her. Bring her to the station. And then quickly let her go so she, she can get to her show. That's so suspicious. Twice. Tell me again. The police officer told me we have to offload all the luggage okay. and to search everything of okay. your luggage. I'm so sorry to, to say that. Like, at least she's not losing her but shit on these that people. Isn't what you planned on doing from the get-go? Why didn't you guys search it before it went on the plane? Uh, they did a, she's being a very calm about encryption. this. I'll give it to her. But now they want to open Why? it. And first of all, because you filmed him and he was like... Because I filmed him? Yeah. Wait. It was like so they now want to search all her stuff because 
she filmed him after they were being very suspect. Yeah, there's something slimy going on here. Uh, he, do he doesn't believe And as you can tell, she's not live streaming anymore. You say. No, he asked me, do I have any more in those purses? And I said no. And yeah. I asked him, where are my bags? They took my bags and put it on the plane before I could know what bags are on the plane. I see. Yeah. So. I'm so sorry for that. Okay, of course. At least she's being well, calm and nice about it. What was say at the end of this first sentence here? Any guesses? I'm going to make you my thumbnail, Bob. Whoa. Um, yeah. It sounds like he's going to say, I'm going to make you my B, Bob. Let's hear that again. Okay, of course. What was he initially going to say at the end of this first sentence here? Any guesses? I'm going to make you my thumbnail, Bob. Yeah, that's how very sus, like he's going to make him his B. <laughs> you think it's funny, Bob, but but when the people hold you accountable, it won't be funny, will it, Accountable Bob? for what? When I hold you accountable, it won't be funny, Bob. Yeah, Bob, I've got a bunch of U.S. district court lawsuits going on. It won't hurt me. Of course, another nut job trying to sue the government over what they think they're being exploited for. Don't get me wrong, the government does exploit people, but it's nut jobs that give people a bad name. A bit to add you and puts all the know. lawsuits together. Bob. Oh, and here's the police. Right, oh, look at that gun right there. How can we help you? Oh, he's getting uh, so surrounded. Need any help. I'm just looking around. Okay, what for? Take a look. Take a look at the building. Okay. Oh, thank you. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. Do nope. you have an appointment with anybody here? No. Do I need an appointment? Oh, he's getting kicked building? out now too. Uh, yeah, you do. And this one. This is not a public building. This is a privately owned building. Could you give me oh, <laughs> right here? Please do not allow children to stand on the tables or chairs. Okay. So. His old issue is that children were standing on tables. And apparently they're saying that it smells like weed in here. So is he high? Oh, does it? Yeah. Well, maybe you guys ought to quit smoking. Thanks, sir. I'd like to know the best. <laughs> None of your business. Oh, okay. Uh, are you trying to go get arrested for trespass and disorderly? For trespassing on public property and He must be high or something. I'm just telling you, this was not a public building. There's public offices inside a private. Who pays for the building? Okay. Uh, oh, my God. So this is one thing I don't like is everyone thinks every single thing is public. You can do whatever you want in public. All buildings are public. No, no, no. There is public buildings and then there's private buildings. Private buildings are usually one of two things, either government owned or privately business owned. And guess what? On those private properties, they can make whatever rules you want and you have to abide by them or get off those properties. Are you guys going to, are you guys trespassing me? Let's cut to the chase. Okay. Do you want to trust me? Let me get your name and badge number. Let me get your name and badge number. Let me get your name and badge number. You're looking right at it. Plus you're recording it. It's time for you to leave. Sir. Name and badge number. Are you going to leave or are you going to jail? Your choice. Name and badge number. If you to leave, you can walk out. <laughs> are you putting your hands on me? Well, oh, he's getting arrested for trespassing now. That's assault. I want him arrested for assault. Sure, right. I want him arrested for assault. <laughs> yeah, they're we really going to arrest him. Talk was lame. Wait until you see how he looks. I want him arrested for assault. Is this going to be this. like a meth head or something? Look at this. I'm going to sue every one of you guys. I'm going to sue every one of you. I love that too. Trespass. Well, first off, he goes into private property, threatens a guy, because obviously he's making a video about this because he said, I'm going to make you my... Space, 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 thumbnail, Bob. Then talk about lawsuits. Talk about how he's on private property when confronted with the police. They say he smells like weed, maybe he's high. Complains about children on the table. Then they go, okay, you can leave or you can be charged with trespassing. And he refuses to leave. And then they arrest him for trespassing. And then when one officer grabs him to arrest him, he goes, oh, arrest him. I want him arrested for assault. Like, come on, guy. Come on, you really think the cops that are arresting you are going to arrest the other cops? 
This guy's gotta be high. Please. You can't trespass me from a public building. It is a public building. Who pays for it? 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 Well, answer it. Who pays for it? I like how people think, oh, it's government owned. That means it's public. You're not going to listen. I'm not saying answer it. Who pays for it? I have more discussions with a three year old. Who pays for it? Yeah, me too. The building is leased. Police? Yeah, leased. It doesn't matter. Oh, so. by the public. Oh, so it's not even like a taxpayer thing. So it's saying that it's leased. So someone is paying, physically paying for that lease, some private citizen or company. So this is technically their private property. So what he's trying to say now is that the public pays for that lease, which they don't. This guy is dumb as hell. This is a very interesting, intelligent person. Well, I'm in my bags over here. My bags over here, clown. All so he left bags here. in the lobby? That's assaulter. not suspicious at all. I want him arrested for assault. You assaulter. I'm handling business. I got business with the pops. I got business with the pops. I'm waiting on a supervisor. I'm waiting on a supervisor. Oh, you're not anymore. Go ask her. Go ask her, by the way. Oh, he just got taken down. Oh, yeah, that's a method. Um, yeah, this is the, this is the phrase. Don't. Oh, look it up. Yeah, this is the phrase. Fuck around and find out. Yeah, resist and res will be the other charge here too. I'm choking as I'm speaking a coherent sentence, okay. That's a really bad, unfortunate angle for that guy with the uh, it's a stereotype belly. of a Karen walks straight out of a cartoon. HOA Karen? Oh god. The worst Karens ever are not retail Karens. They're not fast food Karens, they are HOA Karens because they believe, because they are the head or into the HOA, they own everything about your property, your house, your land, even the people that work there or live there, they have to abide by your rules because you are the HOA Karen. Yeah. My name's Jessica. I'm Is this going to be because of the dog? The dog uh, in the water. I'm bringing a couple of citations over to you guys. Oh, I don't God. Know if you didn't get the memo, you can't have three cars in your driveway. <laughs> uh, ma'am. Oh, my God. She's giving them citations because too many cars. And she just walks in, too, like, no notice or anything. Do you live here? Do you live in that RV out there? You look like the type that would live in wow. an RV. Wow. You me. look First like the all, type that would live in the RV. Out of my yard, or this dog will attack you. That's a warning right there. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure you don't have a permit for that dog either. <laughs> I knew it. How about I knew it. Classic to finish this off. Oh my god. So this is this is a classic one. So this is a transgender person who goes into GameStop and they call him sir instead of ma'am and well Watch this. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure you don't have a permit for that dog either. So, how about an internet classic to finish this off? Excuse me, sir. There's a young man in here. Excuse me, it's ma'am. It's ma'am. <laughs> this is a classic one. You need to settle down and mind your business. Watch him. Okay? It's gonna threaten him too. Once again, ma'am. I said both of you. No, you said sir. Once again, it's ma'am. Bring it outside. You guys, it was a right beforehand. Bring it yes, outside. Sir. Sir? Okay. Take it outside. <laughs> call me, sir, again. I will show you, sir. I that is a classic internet meme. Oh, and there goes the display. I need your corporate number because I'm going to talk, call them and talk about how it's misgendered several times in the store. I apologize for that. I need your corporate number now. Get it for me now. I'm gonna ask you to calm down and stop cussing. Give me your corporate number. Well, I'm gonna ask. And you can tell too, like, there's some issues here where you don't get that angry over something like this. Like, I get it. 
if you're transgender and you get misgendered, yeah, you do get pissed off like that, but not like, let's take it outside and let me beat your ass, bro. Like, that's next level anger. Thank you for the fifth time to stop calling me a man, because quite clearly I am not. And I apologize, I'm sorry for that, ma'am. I will get you that number, is that okay? Yes, get it for me now. I'm asking you to stop Get it for me now. I'm, I'm not cussing. I'm not cussing. Okay. Okay. Give me the damn number now, please. Okay. Ooh. What is that sound? It's like throwing a temper tantrum. But that's just so classic. It's the disrespecting trans people in this store, which I plan on telling the entire LGBTQ community. You're going to lose money over this. It's the classic. It's ma'am. Click the video on screen to watch more videos. Yeah, exactly. That was awesome. Yeah, go subscribe to. What is this? Uh, elusive go subscribe to elusive amazing stuff i love their work